Hi, I'm Dawn Michelle and this is Makeup or Breakup Vlog and today I'm really excited to show you what's in this little white box. What's in it? Hmm. Let's see, shall we? I'm so excited. I think I know what it is, but it's a lovely box in there. Oh my gosh. Can you see this? Do you know who that is? Just one of the icons, beauty icons of the 20th century. The late, great Marilyn Monroe. And this product is from none other than Bessemé Cosmetics. One of my favorite luxe brands out there. Can't wait to see what's in here. Oh my goodness, can you see this? Is that beautiful or what? Besame did a collaboration with the Marilyn Monroe Estate. And I'm so excited that one Mar I didn't think they were going to because so many people have done collaborations with the Marilyn Monroe Estate that I thought maybe it was just too much to ask that Besame would do something with them, but apparently they managed to get something and it came out with three different sets each one more glam and luxurious than the than the first so I went with this particular one because this has the lipstick and the compact and apparently the compact was created after a compact that Marilyn has recorded I guess in some pictures as having used so they tried to reproduce the compact to look like the one that she had. And leave it to Besame to come up with the details because they're all about the details. And I am just loving it. And you see like a little line drawing of her here. You can see that. And I'm gonna put my wheat glasses on so I'll get this correct. I'm just blown away by, again, the quality of Besame always comes through. It says here, Marilyn Monroe Collection, a beauty, a legend, an icon, of course. Marilyn Monroe will be remembered for decades to come, and our collection honors this iconic woman. From the lipstick case to the colors of the cosmetics, everything in this collection is inspired by items from Marilyn's personal vanity. So I just want to show you this little card in here. So this is part of Besame's Iconic Woman series. And in here, it says here, how to get the classic Marilyn Monroe look. Oh my goodness, I gotta try that. <laughs> and it gives you the, what to put for the eyes, the brows, the lips, the face. But you know, there was only one Marilyn. I don't wanna copy her. I just wanna be my own iconic woman. So in this case, it says here for Besame, elegant, classic elegance, modern beauty. And it gives us product descriptions and the ingredient list in case you need to know about that. And apparently this is a refillable com metal compact. <gasps> nice with silver screen powder. That's the name of it. I love their powders. I am blown away by the whole presentation of this. I, I think my last video from Besame was on the Mary Poppins collection that I showed you. And I'll post that video here, here at the end of the video. But the presentation is just out of this world. And then you notice, I'm sure that diamond is no coincidence. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. Let's just pull out this little, oh, and it has weight to it. This is not something you want your children to play with, trust and believe. This is gorgeous. This reminds me of the old fashioned type of, you know, the really retro, beautiful glam. Look at that. Oh, has like that. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, and within you see they have a little, the line drawing again of Marilyn, but it's a piece that you can just take off out of it there. So this design is not within the powder, which would have made it even more iconic. But I feel that sometimes when you put, you know, images and stuff on it, it you don't want to use it, one, and two, it may take away from some of the products, like, you won't get the full amount. 
Mm. There's no scent, which is good. And I'll just, oh, it feels so creamy. So, so creamy. And I'll just put it here. <laughs> well, kind of matches my skin tone. Wow. It's just gorgeous. And I don't know if you can see here, but it actually has Besame name emblazed there on that side. And then over here, oh, I gotta show you this. And then on this side, it reads Marilyn Monroe. Do you see that? I don't know if you can see that. Can you? Oh, it's just so gorgeous. Like I would have this in my purse and just to be like, mm, 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 mm. you know, oh, that's so pretty. Yeah, this is gorgeous. And the weight just, oh, and then here's the lipstick. And of course the diamonds of the girl's best friend. So cute on the top and her signature. I don't know if you could see that. I'm sorry if you can't, my hair is kind of, you know, so. This is supposed to be a red that she would have used if they replicated it. Oh, that is gorgeous. I think it has a bit of an orange tint to it. Okay, I'm just gonna, this has a bit of scent, like a vanilla icing cake type of style. And I just love the how Besame does their lipsticks. They do it two-sided. So you could put the, you can outline your lips with the, with the tip part here, the sharp part, and then you fill it in with the sides. And then you just use either side to keep this pointy. So you keep going. But I'm just gonna put a little here so you can see. Oh, wow. There's the color. Oh, that is intense. Love, 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 love. This is how much product you get. feels so luxurious on the lips. This is incredible. It feels almost like a soft pillow. Mm. And I'm doing this, of course, without a lip liner. So maybe that's not a good idea for those of you who like lip liners. Oh, but it feels so smooth on the lips. Look at that. Gorgeous. I love it. The entire set that they put everything together. And this is called the Essential Marilyn Collection. And this goes for $245 US. And here is what's within. So you will know there is a installment pay plan that they do accept. And I believe it's with Shop Pay, but you may want to double check on the Best Made Cosmetics website. In the Essential Maryland collection, it has, I'm going to try to read this my scratch, off my scratchings as best I can. It has Maryland lashes, like how her lashes would have been back in the day. It's a reproduction of them, okay? There is also mascara that's called the girl's best friend mascara there are several lipsticks in here there's one called misty coral lipstick and this is this the uh, lipstick color that she favored as she went into the 1960s it was like a misty it was like a, a light coral color that she wore on her lip um then there's her there's a couple of other colors there's the carnation red which she probably wore during her time when she was going to uh, the actor's studio uh, in New York. And then there's the Red Hot Red, which is a true fire engine red with a warm yellow toned base. And it's based apparently that particular one on what she wore for lipstick for her film, Some Like It Hot. And I trust Bessemay to get it right. They are great, not just great attention to detail, which is a must, but it's like a, a makeup historian. They're true makeup historians and they make sure with much 
tender, loving care to pay attention to every single detail, to the, the makeup, the color, the style, the packaging, every color that's used is true to the era that is presented for. Uh, they also include two lipstick pencils that are made of wood. They're wooden pencils, so you don't have to worry about adding anything extra that's you know not good for the planet. Uh, and they're in the colors melon and berry. There's an eye uh, brow pencil, I think there is. Yeah, they're, they're, they're eyeliners maybe. I'm sorry, eyeliner pencils. And they're in espresso and snow because she would wear white liner like here to sort of brighten up her eyes and make them pop. Uh, let's see, so we have the lip liners, we have the eyeliners. We have the three different lipsticks. Um, I understand that the lipstick is enriched with plant-based squalene and vitamin E. So that means they feel very good on your lips and very moisturizing. There's also a lip gloss that's called Champagne Glass, which I already love. And it's like a beige uh, gloss that you could wear alone. Very sexy, you know, beautiful. Or over maybe the peach. Um, and what else do we see here? There's a bombshell shadow quad, an eye uh, shadow quad. And it's with colors that are for that time period, 50s, early 60s. And the colors that are listed are peach, cream, top, and light brown. So this is a lot for, you know, just having this all. It also reads that the Misty Coral lipstick has a, um, a creamy texture with a satin finish. So at least you don't have to worry about extra something on your on your mouth. But that's a lot. And for their aesthetics and the attention to detail that they put in here and how they are so on point with the time period of the colors and uh, the presentation of the packaging, $245 sounds like a lot, but it's actually pretty good, especially since they have a four, uh, in, four uh, installment plan. They have like... Uh, four installments to pay off. So that's pretty good. It's like, I think it's 61.25 each installment plan. Um, then the next one, which is the one I got is the red carpet compact and lipstick set. And that was a $405. And you already saw what I got in there and I am loving it. Cause I'm more of a lipstick compact girl myself. I don't wear a ton of mascara. <laughs> I'm, I'm not into the whole like glam look like if I really wanted to go Viva Glam like a la Marilyn then I totally would have invested in the $245 package but a lot of the stuff in here like I don't wear falsies I don't wear lashes mascaras you know here and there coral lipstick I like but it's not my particular favorite but if you are an aficionado of Marilyn and you must must have it then I say please by all means if you've got the means and you want this, you should definitely get it. It is a great investment. Uh, and then the final third here is to the individual Red Hot Lipstick by itself. And that is in the Marilyn Monroe design done with her signature and it's for 26 US dollars. So there you have all of those three options. If you can't go for one, you can go for the other. If you just want the lipstick, go for the lipstick. Just to have a little bit, a little piece of the late great Marilyn Monroe. In the comments below, what do you think? And if you haven't already, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell so you will know my next video will be up. Loving this already.